Tuesday. We are back to do a part two of the Festival of the Arts. First time we were headed straight to the airport, so we didn't get much. I know, so it's been a long time. We're here to catch up on things that we didn't get, so come along with us, see what we get when we get it, and yeah, we'll just have a good old time walking around. Yeah, I know at least three booths back to back to back, so we'll show you those. Uh, but yeah, give us a thumbs up and subscribe and come along. But first, look at this artwork. Look at this. Yeah, the guitar is cool. All right. First sale right away, cuisine, classy. And I'm going to have to try this beef wellington. The picture actually looks really good. Alright, the Wellington looks very good. It looks well done though, and we're a little surprised. At the size. It looks like a sliver for $8.75. But I think we have more of the sauce than we do the Wellington. The sauce looks very good. We're just gonna cut that right down the middle but and the flavor may be there. So the portion is small, but this flavor is really, really, really good. And then the sauce. So, I just wish there was twice as much, but yeah, it's very good. One carrot and one onion. But yeah, this is mashed potato and very garlicky, very good. As Andy said, just wish there was more of the Wellington. Yeah, it's really, really good. It makes you want the whole Wellington. But anyway, we tried. It just means we get to try more things, right? Mm. <laughs> All right, chalk art last time. Uh, they only have one today. It's definitely a lot more. Oh, that one's a little washed out. Oh, look at this one. That's cool. That's a good stitch. Of course, I knew that somewhere. Somewhere I knew that. Stitch. Figment. Oh, there you go. Andrew is definitely partial to figment, and it does look very nice. <laughs> oh, Donald got a little washed out too. Oh. Whoa! Look at this one. That's nice. The things people can do with chalk. I mean, that looks like a bowl of fruit sitting there. Yeah. And then here's a really Do they still big have art. the... Oh, well, they don't have it anymore. This was the one that down there, if you stood in a certain spot, it looked like you were falling in the painting. Are those cool or are those cool? Did anybody and there's have a, whole... a favorite? Yeah, let us know. There's a whole other side to show, but we'll maybe show that in a little bit. All right, our, our next sale here, we're trained uh, Deco Delights. They have Neapolitan Dessert Trio and Espresso Martini, which we missed from the cruise. So, <laughs> look at these over here. Okay, so we got all these from uh, Deco Delights, but I'm excited about the colors on these beers. Look at that. So that's got to be the uh, Milk Stout, which looks really good. Vanilla Porter, Strawberry Blonde Nitro. Those all sound good. But then look at the dessert. It's a Neapolitan. Is that what it's called? Neapolitan Dessert Trio. And then we have Espresso Martini. All right, we'll start with a little cheer. Gosh, this Milk Stout is crazy. Cheers. A little bitter, but you still might like it. All right, this is very good. If you've watched our videos before, you know I like the dark beers. Yeah, that's good. I don't like it, but I'm not a beer person. 
And this is key All right, so lime. that's strawberry. Oh, no, I'm sorry. This is that's, Neapolitan. Yeah, that's strawberry, Neapolitan. All right, I I actually do like the strawberry. I'm not big on Neapolitan. Yeah, the strawberry is really good. But, like, hmm. Yeah, so let me try the all right, vanilla porter. Whoa. Okay, that's my favorite. Vanilla porter, very, very good. Last but not least, the uh, strawberry blonde, strawberry blonde nitro. Ooh. Yeah, I don't like that one so much. That's I like this best. one better than. All right, I'm gonna try the vanilla. So the vanilla's like cheesecake. Hmm. All right. It is like cheesecake. I know. It's I think I do like I did like the strawberry better. I'm not big on cheesecake. And I'm really not big on chocolate, so. Mm. <laughs> this is good. It's like a chocolate tart. Okay. This booth was not on our three that we were going to try, but I'm glad we stopped. So, oh, the chocolate is not as overpowering of like chocolate as I thought, so I think I'm going to go the strawberry chocolate and then the um cheesecake vanilla vanilla cheesecake. i'm surprised about the chocolate and i tried her uh espresso martini i thought it was good and i literally got okay so all these are pretty much winners except for the strawberry but yeah so the flight is also neapolitan so okay. vanilla, chocolate, and strawberry. And strawberry. Okay, we're gonna try Craftsman's Courtyard. We don't normally try things like this, but grilled pork belly, we may try that. Coffee, old fashioned cocktail. Can't get this, but that looks fabulous. Skirt steak, holy cow. <laughs> okay, we have the pork belly and then the coffee, old fashioned. So. We'll see how this is. It looks interesting. We heard the pork belly's good. Coffee old fashioned sounds interesting. Okay, so this pork belly is kind of hard to eat. Oh, probably can't see it, but it's very fatty. Yeah, very fatty in parts. And it's a mess. <laughs> it is a mess. So I guess the little bit of mm, well, actual the peppers meat are good. I had tasted all right, but definitely the cheese and peppers are really good, and there's very crisp toast on the bottom. We just don't have good light where we could only get the good parts of the meat. I think that's probably good. So this is the old fashioned. Ooh. It's definitely coffee flavor. In a jalapeno. I'm not sure what would make it old-fashioned. I don't know. What do you think of that? I don't like him. I'll have the cherry. All right, so this whole thing for me is a miss. Yeah, a no-go on both no. of these. So this has probably been our biggest miss. The pork belly, too fatty. Uh, the cheese was okay. Parts of it were good. It had a kick with the jalapenos, but you know. And this, I had high hopes for coffee old-fashioned, but... It just tastes like old, bitter coffee, yeah. honestly, and I don't get anything else other than that. Um, but yeah, so we're going to have to say this was no not good. for us. But that's exactly how to say it. Just bitter coffee and... Yeah. All right, so on to the next. On to the next. Look at how colorful these are. Very cool. Which one's your favorite? I gotta go with good old Pluto, but 
sadly, Goofy is a tie. <laughs> <laughs> Those are very cool. They're all really cool, though. I like how bright they are. Yeah. What are we getting? Uh, so, with our food, we said the secret code of Dom sent us. So, we're getting the Art Margarita. It's a secret drink. So if you know, you know. If you know, you know. Don't tell anyone. There you go. The ah. man Thank you, thank you. Perfect, thank you. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you. All right, so we have the carne asada. It's like steak, and this is supposed to be lobster bites tostada. And then we have an arcarita on the secret menu. You had to say a secret phrase to get this. It was Dom sent me. <laughs> but yeah, look at that's That's so cool. Very right. picturesque margarita. Right? Yeah. Oh, that's good sirloin. Yeah, sirloin steak. And then it's like a fried piece of cheese. And then there's like some sweet something or other that you put on the carne asada. And it tastes really good. I'm not sure what it is, but... It's like a fried mozzarella. Yeah, in like a pancake form. It's, yeah, it's really browned good. on one side. Yeah, that is really good. I think I like this better than the meat. All right, so this is supposed to be lobster bites and tostada. So I think I like this more than the carne asado. Hmm. Not bad. Whoa, almost went oh. right in the drink. <laughs> yeah. I have to agree. The tostada is better than the carne asada. Yeah, but I did like the fried cheese that it came with. Kind of bland over here. Yeah. But this is full of flavor. Uh oh. Uh oh. All right, I'm gonna go in on this one. Give it a go. So, Art Garita, this was like a, a secret drink. Yeah, so if you follow La Cava on Instagram, they let you in on what the secret code is. In order to order this drink, you couldn't just say, I want to get the Art Garita. All right, that's real good. You had to say, Dom sent me. Yeah, try that. Although I think it's made with that mezcal, but whatever the blue that he added in helps kind of sudden yeah. the mezcal flavor. Yeah, that's right. So it's not as strong of a mezcal flavor. All right, so overall, yeah, good. I could have did without the carne asada. We just each have one of these maybe in a drink, but all right, we've tried a lot of stuff. I don't know if there's time for more, we'll see, but. So far, we tried a lot more than the other, the last time. Yeah. Okay, so what do we have? Uh, we got the artisan cookie that we can't paint, but uh, it looks we good. We can't paint? <laughs> it looks good, though. <laughs> and um, it, the cookie looks lovely, though. It does. And we got the blood orange... Cosmo. Uh, Cosmo. I already tried that, and it is very, very blood orangey. So, oh, well, I may like it. Yeah. But, but the, cookie the cookie is nice and soft. So you're saying we can't paint? No. It's kind of dried. Uh, <laughs> so, ones we've seen normally, you could like paint and make like a little design. Apparently, we can't paint with this. But, it's a good cookie. It looks really good. It's soft. I want to know where the missing bit of the cookie is. They didn't charge you for that. I kind of want that back. All right, let's try the drink. It smells blood orangey. Yeah, it really hits you. So the blood orange is very bitter, almost like a, like almost eating the orange rind. Second drink is better when you know what to expect. <laughs> Have a bite of the cook. 
The cookie is definitely better than the one we had last year. We had this last year and it was very thin and like overly crispy, but this one is good. It's soft. It's a good one. All right, we'll show you the other side on our way out. So the right side, whoa, look at this one. Wow. Ah. Oh, cool. <laughs> yeah, these are good. Oh, jellyfish. That's washed out. Oh, look at the puppy. Aww. Seal. That one's kind of washed out. Yeah, a lot of these are yes. a bit faded. Oh, it's... I nailed it. Tink. Oh. All right, very good. Well, here, what if I choose two and you choose two? So the first decision, Andy has to pick four colors here. Make sure they all go together. Those look kind of cool. Maybe. I kind of like the minty color. Mint? Is it, it's not going to come back at me. All right. Perfect. This one. All right, that's cool. That's cool. Okay. And then she said you can hold and then pull down towards you. Yeah. Look, and he already did this spiral. Oh. He already did it. Very good. So what's the other maneuver I should do? You can do like little dots throughout it. Oh. Oh. Oh my gosh. Don't do that. Don't worry. Trust the process. And then drag it straight out towards the Oh wow. Okay, okay. That's so cool. Can I check it out or keep going? Uh, maybe a little more red. Yeah, do a tiny bit more red. Oh. Okay. Okay. Uh, all right, let's big see. Big reveal. Oh, oh, there we go. You're all a right, Picasso. Cool. Hey, you are Picasso. That's awesome. That is so cool. Look, there's a little moon in blue. Oh, oh yeah, a little moon in there. Do you add more colors? Or do you like that? Uh, colors. And you can hold it close. And that's one that I think. Yeah. And then Hold it close. Hold it close. Hold it close. Think so. I think right. so. Right. Cool. Oh. We, cool. we still have we a little Batman with some glitter. Okay, <laughs> end of the night, there's no line for the magnet. Look at this, no line, no line, no line, no line. Thank you. There it is. Thank, Thank you. you. It's the reveal shot. <laughs> Look at it. Okay, everybody, that was our night at Epcot. It was a super fun night. Yeah, so we got new foods. We even did the uh, bicycle art. Yeah, we got a lot of food booths and, I don't know, just a lot of fun. Yeah, this was, like, just a really fun night. So every night at Epcot's different. Every night's fun. Yes. And so. if every night is not different, you're not doing it right. <laughs> That's <so>. right. <laughs> yes. All right, well, so. thanks for coming along. Give us a thumbs up. Leave a comment, and see you next time. All right. See you next time.